Welcome to Windows XP from Microsoft, the new version of Windows that brings your PC to life. Hey guys, in case you missed Windows XP, there is a way to get it back. And uh, by getting it back, you get back a Windows 10 that has a Windows XP mask on top of it. And here today, we're going to take a look at it if it's what it claims to be. The name of it is Windows Experience. XP experience get it so yes it is found somewhere in the archives that i got it unfortunately i'm not sure if i can leave a link to this one but you can search windows xp reins on archives and uh, you should get an iso file and uh, i installed it here in the machine just to see how this uh, even works and most of the stuff actually works just like it was an xp including my extremely favorite game, which is Pinball. As you see, it still works like a charm, which in my opinion, that is something that I might spend a few hours playing. And here we go. Let me just hit it and see if it actually works. And that is the lowest hit you've ever seen in probably your life, because I probably haven't played this game in, uh, I don't know, 15 years, I would say at least 15. And I actually miss it. Now, besides playing this game, which I lost here, you have almost everything you used to have on uh, Windows XP. Now, if they all work, I am not sure. Windows Movie Maker, for one, is right here and looks like it would, but it doesn't exactly work. So if you want to try to fidget with it, I could not make it work for the life of me. I tried to put some of these videos here, drag and drop. If I go import video, go to desktop, as you see clearly there on desktop, I could not add them. But for some reason, if you find a way to make that work, please let us know in the comments below. And here we have the famous Windows Messenger that you can click here to log in. I don't have an account and I cannot confirm if that works. There is another one that I actually tried, the MSN. And if you go through the registration, select count, country and all that, it's not going to work because the servers for this one are gone. As far as I know, it will be unavailable i'm not sure if it works in another country i did not try that but as far as for the united states it did not work and yes you can install all, all modern software as you see here i have brave for example and i can go on uh, let's say youtube.com the internet's not being very fast but the system works because it's basically a windows 10 that just uh looks like a windows xp and if i go here it will go to my channel and find the videos and all that cool stuff as you see it works and but on itself it has this internet explorer wannabe which is basically a mozilla as you see right here on top masked to look like a i don't know what this stuff here is now <laughs> to look like internet explorer sometimes it does this part here and what else do we have here we have all programs here uh video land which is what we installed today outlook express i am not sure if that works anymore trillion you have the games free cell hearts and all that accessories with a magnifier narrator hyper terminal network entertainment sound recorder that's a lot of entertainment address book calculator let me check the calculator if it's what i remember and yes it is let me see if it has uh paint actually that would be very interesting and it oh yeah there is paint right here and yes it feels like going back to a i don't know childhood memory i guess i'm not sure if if i can even use this thing anymore it's been so so long so you can undo it wow this really has been long that i haven't touched this one wow experience yeah that is not gonna work with a mouse and my calligraphy is way better than that by the way but with a mouse uh 
just I can't really get it right and no I'm not gonna save it but yeah paint is right here and that is what matters most outlook is right here as well and you can go ahead and give it a shot if you still have an outlook account or g not gmail hotmail I think they uh change it to later if I'm not wrong on that one and uh windows catalog what is that doesn't open and I'm not gonna go with a uh, whatever that is my documents and the folders actually they did a good job on designing the buttons and all that good stuff as you see right here i don't have any received files but basically you have it just like it used to be let me go to uh control panel and see what's happening with control panel right here and looks like they tried to design everything back to xp style but they definitely look way more polished which is because of windows 10 and it makes a lot of sense and here at the bottom you have stuff that's still open this is the safely remove hardware and eject media the sound itself and and if you remember the properties uh don't click on appearance because for some reason it uh crashes and boom goes away so besides that if you go to properties this part here desktop all the stuff that used to be works if you remember any of these right here the tulips the wind i think that was a later version we go back to bliss i don't know why this one feels better screensavers this was my really favorite thing let me put the, um, the tech right here and i'm gonna hit okay and preview it and this is something that sends me a long time back wow blank is just blank let me see if bubbles works oh yeah just how i remember them wow mystify yes mystify kind of works i don't know what it's doing right now but yeah yeah it's working but i just i forgot how it used to build up these kind of motion motion pictures whatever you want to call that ribbons wow i'm missing now i'm not sure if i'm mixing memories here but didn't there used to be another uh option here like some kind of pipes or 3d pipes or something like that if i'm not mistaken it with uh windows 98 or 2000 i might be mis mistaken it for it and here are the colors 32 bit that's a lot of colors 1920 by 1080 because i don't want to go beyond what the virtual machine allows me here restart before applying the color settings svga 3d of course color management and basically this is kind of it actually so this is just a beautiful project if you are kind of missing the days of using windows xp just for the aesthetics of it but besides that the whole thing is a windows 10 and nothing else it's not really anything uh to do with xp except for the i would call it the theme itself but you can install all the games and all that stuff that you would install in a windows 10 and they will work just perfectly fine and uh, let me go to the information about this computer and see what it shows up uh on the information part of it and here is the system and as you see right here it just says 64 bit operating system because in here it says xp professional x64 edition good luck with that 1985 2006 but in reality this is a windows 10 and i think they did a great job whoever developed this one in my opinion this is just a beautiful thing to have if you if you just want to run it on your main computer and you know you have a windows 10 which is fairly modern uh system but you want to run it based on a xp just to give you back the probably good memories i don't know a lot of people that had bad, bad memories actually from uh windows xp and this is just something that i don't know how to explain it just looks good feels good and just overall has a good 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 feel about it and as you see if you go to these uh settings for example you get back to windows 10 settings this is windows 10 now <laughs> it's not uh it says windows is isn't activated obviously it's not activated this is for just fun right now that i downloaded and installed this one to show you guys that yeah if, if you want it there is an option to do this one and uh, let me see if we can find info here account info processor show all results yeah they they did a good job actually even masking the name here inside the windows 10 settings edition windows xp professionals x64 edition <laughs> Ha ha ha.
this is actually really nice how how they manage to do all that stuff here and and the funny part is that if you go to task manager they try to give it like a older theme and here are the process processes which are definitely not xp really basic themer and the installation failed for some reason whatever that is and uh, yeah there's really not much else to talk about but it's just a beautiful piece of software if you miss windows xp and its look so you now can have it back and uh, play with it as you wish and let me just shut it down so you guys can have a look of how it looks shut it down you will see that windows 10 peeks up through it and as you see this is windows 10 and with that said i hope you enjoyed this video and we will see you next time bye